When the trick-or-treaters come around Thursday night, you may notice some non-traditional colors on their Halloween gear. So if you happen to see blue or teal pumpkin buckets, that's meant to signal something important to you. Kim DiGiulio explains. This Halloween, as you prepare to hand out candy to trick-or-treaters, you're going to want to pay special attention to the color of the candy bucket that children are carrying. As ghosts and goblins invade your doorstep this Halloween, some of those trick-or-treaters could be children with autism. You would know because there's a good chance they will be carrying a blue bucket or jack-o'-lantern. I think that increased awareness is so important and it's just a sign that people are becoming more aware of autism and autism spectrum disorders. Dr. Dana Cohen, director of the Autism Evaluation Center at Beaumont, says Halloween can be a lot for children with an autism spectrum disorder. Inbred in the tradition is to go up to somebody's home and interact with them, ask for the candy, say trick or treat. Even that could be difficult and anxiety provoking. Along with the social expectations that Halloween brings, Halloween costumes and decorations can be a lot to handle too. If there's lots of decorations around, if there's a lot of noise, even if the even temperature changes, things like that, any kind of sensory input can be overwhelming to them. Dr. Cohen says if you do see that blue candy container, it doesn't mean that you have to treat that child any differently. Just be aware of what they could be going through. I would initially treat them like I treat everybody else, you know, which is just, hi, trick or treat, I love your costume, and see kind of gauge their response. Um, and if there isn't a response or if it's something that you're not expecting to just give the candy and move on, give a smile. Another color you're gonna to wanna to look out for this Halloween is the color teal. If a child is carrying a teal candy bucket, that likely means they have a food allergy to something like tree nuts or peanuts. I'm Kim DiGiulio, Local 4.